Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Now in this video, I am going to discuss a few important questions from the chapter Nuclei, that is the 30th chapter. This is with reference to your forthcoming board examination. So the first question is, write short note on discovery of neutron by Chadwick. Now answer to this question is given in page number 440. Then you have give examples of isobars and isotones. Okay, they may also ask you examples of isotopes. So this is given in page number 441. Next is show that nuclear density is a constant for all nucleides. Okay. Discussion on binding energy curve and what are the important features of binding energy curve. So this is given in page number 444. What are the properties of nuclear force? Okay. This is given in page number 445. Then you may be asked to prove these relations nt that is number of nuclei at time t is equal to n naught e power minus lambda t. This r is equal to r naught e power minus lambda t. This r is the activity. Half life t half is equal to 0 0.693 by lambda or ln 2 natural log 2 by lambda. Then mean life is equal to 1 by lambda. Tau is equal to 1 by lambda. Then this is the relation between half life and mean life. So all these mathematical relations are given in page number 448. Then you have what are alpha decay, beta decay, gamma decay and electron capture. So this is given in page number 449 and 451. Next is state the difference between nuclear fission and nuclear fusion. Discuss the working of nuclear reactor and what are the various components of the nuclear reactor. Then state the function of moderators. So this is given in page number 453 to 455. Definition of thermonuclear reaction, page number 456. What is proton-proton cycle? So this is given in page number 456. Write short note on nuclear winter. Okay, that is in blue color portion in page number 457. How can radioactive nuclei emit beta particles even though they do not contain them? Why all electrons emitted during beta decay don't have same energy? Define activity of radioactive substance. Okay. Number 15, explain the release of energy during fission and fusion on the basis of binding energy curve. Okay. Draw a graph showing the number n of undecayed nuclei as a function of time t for a given radioactive sample having half-life t half. Now this is with reference to the nuclear reactor. What is multiplication factor for what value of k? So k is the multiplication factor. The operation of nuclear reactor is said to be critical. Explain mass defect and binding energy. What is a packing fraction of nucleus? Why do stable nuclei never have more protons than neutrons? Okay. Then please solve these solved examples 13.1, 10.3 and so on. And these exercise problems and this additional exercise problem. Okay. Additionally, you may also try out these numericals. Okay. These are important numericals. Okay. Now, the link to download this document will be given in the description box. So, you can click the link and download this document in PDF format. Okay. So, my best wishes for your board examinations. Good luck.